to Lindenwald now, where the Lions welcome Paulsboro to town. Lindenwald in a must-win situation to try and sneak into the Group 1 playoffs. Meanwhile, the defending champion Red Raiders with a chance to clinch the number one seed. Opening possession of the game, and Paulsboro comes out throwing. Colin McCarthy airs it out to Jacob Perez-Eli, who makes the catch. A nice grab from the sophomore, Perez-Eli. And later in the drive, McCarthy going up top one more time. He connects with Basil Tutton for the touchdown. The Red Raiders making it look easy through the air as Paulsboro takes a 7-0 lead. The Lions doing their best to keep Deron Holloway in check. David Murphy flies in to lower the boom for Lindenwald. Murphy, he's fired up. The Lions with the football now. Devin Baker swings a pass out to Marquez Haywood, and the junior tight end is able to break a tackle. But watch Holloway strip the ball away. It's a fumble. Nasir Bateman dives on it, and Paulsboro gets the football right back. We are still in the first, and the Red Raiders set up the screenplay. McCarthy to Perez-Eli. Jacob Perez-Eli with another big play, and this one goes for a touchdown. 14-zip Paulsboro after one. 48 to 16 the final. The Red Raiders finish the regular season at 7 and 1. They'll be home to open the playoffs next Saturday. Lindenwald drops to 3 and 5 and will get a consolation game. I'm Mike Frankel for jerseysportszone.com.